Today was the second day of group play in the Women's Olympic Footballing Tournament, and we were treated to some great action once again. Canada took on France in the first match of Group A, and despite the third goal of the first round by Marie Antoinette Cototo, Canada responded with two goals from Vanessa Gilles and Jessica Fleming to get the win. However, because of the spying scandal with the drone, the Olympic Committee has docked Canada six points, and that keeps them in third place. The second match in Group A was between Colombia and New Zealand. Two goals from Lacey Santos and... Marcella Restrepo were enough to propel Colombia past New Zealand. And because Canada upset France, Las Chicas Superporosa has vaulted into the top spot in Group A. On to Group B, United States took on Germany, and it was not close as United States thumped Germany 4-1. Sophia Smith got a brace and another goal from uh, Mallory Swanson and Lynn Williams were enough to just completely dismantle the German defense and really make USA look like the favorite for the gold medal. The second match in Group B was between Australia and Zambia, and this was a show from the beginning as Australia was able to survive a late push from Zambia to win 6-5. This is the highest scoring match, men or women, in the Olympics thus far, and despite Barbara Banda getting a uh, a hat trick for Zambia, Australia was able to hold on. Now, Australia is in third place in Group B, and United States topped the group with six points, and USA has already locked up their spot in the next round. In Group C, J Japan took on Brazil, and they won 2-1. And the last match of the day was between Spain and Nigeria, and Alexia Putelis in the 85th minute slotted one home uh, to give Spain the win. Now, Spain is on top of Group C with six points, and Japan is in second with three points. Another great day of action. Let's hope that it continues. Stay here for more updates.